Alright guys, hey guys, welcome back to another episode, as you guys can see, but from the last two videos, I didn't edit my videos, because I was gone, and I was busy, I recorded them Friday, and didn't edit them um, at all, but here I am, back with an edited video, probably, hopefully, maybe not, I don't know, but these are the multiple things I am, these are the seven things I cannot wait for, for the Arrowverse. So the Arrowverse shows are coming back. Uh, in one, two, three, four. I'm coming back in four days with the start of Bat Girl, the Bat, Bat Woman and Supergirl. And so, yeah, I'm going to be talking about what I can't wait for, for these seasons and what this show has, what these, what I have planned and what I'm going to possibly do, brothers. Okay. <clears throat> And I can't wait to watch all these shows. Um, again, I can't wait to start uh, our verse recaps again because they're going to be dope and awesome. They're probably not going to be edited. I don't know. I'll, I'm still thinking about that because Wednesday I come here, record them, and then I upload. And so I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> Got it. But yeah, here we go. So, number one. Oliver going through different Earths. That's basically what this season is possibly for. He might, but I can't really tell much. Or he might be going to a different time. He might be going, he might be going, I don't know exactly what's going on. But I hope he's going throughout the multiverse to find heroes to help him join fight. Or he's going out throughout times and grabbing people from the past, but either way, I can't wait to see what Oliver does. I, I, that's the one thing I cannot, that is one of the main things I cannot wait for, and also, it's the final season of Arrow, as my final year, as a, uh, going to school. It's so cool. Um, number two, the Crisis on Infinite Earths, uh, event. Uh, they have started production at the time of, or yesterday, as the time I'm recording this, um, which is Tuesday, where all the Supermen are together for the crossover. Um, yeah. Um, a lot of crisis news. You can go to my What We Got from the Arrowverse Comic Con trailers and stuff, we did, which we didn't get much. Just to put that out there. Uh, yeah. Um, the second half, big bad for the Flash. The, okay, so people, Paige especially, has been saying that it is negative Flash or whatever, and then eventually a girl from the comics, a girl takes that negative power from him and becomes a bad guy, which I kind of hope that is because we do not need another negative Flash. We've already had that, basically. It's basically Savitar. Our negative Flash was Savitar. And they've basically been, uh, got, uh, Canada Graphs have been getting behind the scenes photos of all of these and um, yeah and so apparently he looks like negative flash but then I'm like but why tease red red death in the season before if you're not even gonna use him in the next season or next few seasons and so what do you what do you, what's 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 red flash where where is he gonna come to this? And then, during the crossover, I knew I had basketball, because I knew, like, episode 8 of Era when I come came home, it was a game day or whatever. So, all I know is that the crossover is going to be during basketball. Uh, number four, uh, historical figures in legend. Um, we saw Anea or Nia, or whatever the girl's little girl's name was, the girl that went, helped Constantine and Ray, or no, Nora and Ray, no, Nora and Constantine, um, and uh, Astra, Astra, that's her name, Astra, Astra let out the, and we figured out about these coins that you can revive someone if you give it to them, and so she let out super sinners. Which are historical figures that are bad, bad historical figures, and she just let them out again, and so 
historical figures, bad historical figures are gonna be back out there in the world. And hopefully, I, hopefully, in the past, we've always been learning something about the past in my class, or, um, or a movie kind of came out for it. Like, The Greatest Showman was with the Sabretooth Tiger and The Greatest Show. I don't know what episode that is of Legends. I think it's like episode 2 of Legends of Tomorrow Season 3. And, yeah. Uh, yeah, historical figures. Um, and then I just want... Uh, I want the Nazis and the Holocaust to come back or whatever. Hitler would be back. Or whatever, and they stop him. That would be really cool. Um, uh, number five, Sarah's powers. Uh, in the and the first time we might actually see her use them is in the crossover because uh, the crossover uh, airs before their first episode. And so, yeah. Um. Yeah, so Sarah's powers, we don't know what they are going to be, but she's going to get to powers at some point, and she'll be using them in the crossover, hopefully. If she doesn't use them in the crossover, that sucks, and it would be like a weird plot point that she gets her powers like in episode 6, 7, or whatever, and then she doesn't use them in the crossover. Like, what? Um... Uh, number six, how James exits the show. Um, we got this intel from Comic-Con that he is leaving the show and then they were all loving on him. And so, yeah, James is leaving the show, but I just want to see how that happens. And, yeah. Uh, number seven, many, many twists and turns. Like plot twists or twists from the reverse flash again. Um... And, uh, in the twist that Lena actually is the big bad, or Midnight is a one-off villain. And, uh, also, going back to Flash stuff, um, whatever that, con whatever the one big bad from 1 to 8, and then 8 to 22, a big bad will be different for both halves of the season. For, like, blood work is 1 through 8, and then 9, and then the crossover, and then 10 through 22 is another big bad, but we just don't know what it is yet. Hopefully it's not Negative Flash. If Negative Flash is that, then I mean, it's okay, and I'll see what they'll do with it. So, uh, all of are going, going through different Earths, Crisis on Infinite Earths event, uh, second half big bad for Flash, historical figures, and legends, uh, Sarah's powers, uh, how James exits the show and many twists and turns. Okay, Wayne, edit out or er, edit out the, the outro and then move it to after this. Got it. So yeah, so that's where you would cut it. Okay, okay. So. Yeah, those are my seven things I cannot wait for. Uh, I cannot, I cannot wait to see in the Arrowverse. So yeah, all right, guys. Hope you guys like this video. If you guys did, please leave a big like down below. And if you guys haven't already, please subscribe. Adios. Then take that little snippet, throw it onto that end. Got it? Okay, yep.